Hey y'all. Well, I have to share something with you that I did. I bought a fourth sewing machine. <laughs> yeah. Um, when I first started quilting over a year ago, I thought, hmm, why do people need more than one sewing machine? Um, well, one, maybe two be enough. But as I have come to really love quilting, just love it, I totally get it now. Like, I see how that happens. Um, so anyway, I participated in the Better Together Quilt Along by um, Elizabeth Chapel of Quilters Candy. And I'm also a new Quilters Candy member, so if you haven't checked that out, check her out. Um, there's a lot of great resources. She's got a great tutorial. Anyway, in this Quilt Along, there were prizes each week. And one of the prizes was a sewing machine at the very end. And I thought, oh, you know, that would be fun to win, especially when I learned about the machine and what it does. But then I quickly realized there are over 700 people participating in this quilt along. And the odds of me getting it were pretty slim. I didn't win it, but it was a fun quilt along uh, making a um, quilt out of half square triangles. So great beginner quilt too if you want to try that. Anyway, Elizabeth Chapel, this is your fault, but in a good way. I did not win the sewing machine, but I started researching it, finding out more about it, how it worked, and I bought one. So now I have four. So let me show you what the sewing machine is. This is the Sashiko Baby Lock sewing machine. It's a Sashiko 2, and it just does an embroidery stitch. Um, that is like a straight embroidery stitch. It, it looks like when you hand um, stitch your binding or your quilt. Some of you do that and it's absolutely beautiful. And I've done a little bit of it in a hoop, but it's pretty time consuming for me and with working full time and some other responsibilities, it's just not something I have time to do. So when I found out about this machine, Elizabeth, um, I was like, oh my goodness, I never knew this even existed. Like. I'm gonna have to check it out. So long story short, I found one on Facebook Market um, in another state. It would have been six, seven hours round trip. It was brand new. And um, I wanted to see if it was a good deal. So I called my dealer just to see how much they are. And when they found out, you know, that I was considering getting it somewhere else, they asked me how much. And I told them, and they actually met the price of the um, the new one I was gonna get from a lady on Facebook market and I'm all about buying stuff you know used or secondhand um, or I love yard sales and thrift stores I love old things so like there's an example there of an old um, Pepsi um, delivery um, container where the bottles would go in so I'm kind of an old soul with old things um, but anyway, this is brand new and I went ahead and bought it because I thought what a great way to make these beautiful stitches but in a much faster way. So anyway, I now have four sewing machines and I understand exactly how it happens. So I haven't used it yet. I just took it out of the box. And if you haven't seen it, it looks, um, it's a very simple looking sewing machine. Uh, everything is done from the bobbin. So all the sewing happens here. This is where the thread goes. Um, this that you see up here is strictly just for winding your thread on the bobbin. Like you don't thread this. There's not a needle that comes down. You don't thread it through there. It's all through there. And it does a really, really pretty stitch. This one was already in there. So this is how it came to show you the kind of stitch. And you can change the stitch length and spacing so you can see that here of you can adjust it however you want so that's what it looks like and then it comes with um, a Sasha Co um, project book and it also comes with the owner's manual and then it also comes with this great uh, first project on how to use it and 30 weight thread. So this machine likes 30 to 100 weight thread. And I found a lady, her name is Evie, um, Evie Hawkins, I think. And she has this machine and she does all kinds of amazing things with it. And so I've been watching her videos. And pretty much 30 to 40 weight polyester or good quality cotton thread. 
um, and she talks all about it. Even It even works well with um, Coates and Clark thread too, which is just you know a very economical thread that you can get pretty much anywhere. Um, so anyway, I have some thread on the way to be able to use. And what's interesting with this machine is that um, it, it when you use like 40 weight thread, the way it pulls it up, it actually looks like it's doubled. So it looks like 20 weight thread, uh, which is pretty neat. So anyway, I am now the proud owner of the Sasha Co. Baby Lock machine. And there was one before it. So this is the Sasha Co. 2. Um, so if you've got this machine and you've made things with it, let me know. I'd love to follow you and see some of your projects and then I'll post some of mine as I learn how to use it too. So anyway, I'm really excited about it. I'm so glad I participated in the Better Together Quilt Along. Um, even though I didn't win, I learned all about this machine and I'm happy to be now a new proud owner of what I'll call her Sasha. So stay tuned. <laughs>